back to Hey Kentucky. The annual Lexington Rodeo was this weekend, so we sent Hey Kentucky correspondent Rebecca Sanders to go check out the most exciting eight seconds in sports. Take a look. Hey Kentucky, I'm Rebecca Sanders, and today I am at the Lexington Rodeo. This is my first rodeo, so I don't know what to expect, but I'm pretty dang excited. As soon as that gate opens, the time starts, and you got to stay on him eight seconds, not touch him with your other hand. This is our fourth year, fourth year of doing the rodeo right. here. Yeah. So. So now you guys are really in the swing of things, coming up with some new ideas. Well, new ideas, yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. That'll be fun. Yeah. There are some other games that we could play, but I don't think they'd be allowed with the insurance company. So. <laughs> I drove six hours to come to this rodeo. So. Yeah, this is my first time in Kentucky, so it's very exciting. Welcome. Apparently, this is going to be really. This is my first rodeo. You picked a I've good one ever for the been first to the time. Rodeo before. Did you know yeah. that this is the second richest rodeo this week, second to Reno, Nevada? That's what I heard. It's Reno and then us. Yes. Who'd have thunk it? Yes, it's fantastic. We are so excited. Do you guys do a lot of bull riding in Syria? Uh, not much. Not much. <laughs> not many bulls left. <laughs> Well, that's sad. No, there there weren't any. There were never so, bulls yeah, in Syria. Not really, not that. Other kinds of milk that you drink. Other yes. kinds of milk. Well, no, I mean they're good. It's well, good. You don't drink milk from bulls. You try not. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's something I've always really been interested in. It's like the announcer voice. It's like a yeah. thing. Like, well, the announcer voice is. If I walked around and used my announcer voice all the time. Okay, I mean, I would, I, I would, I would shatter every room because right, I, like, I do it. I walk into a restaurant. I'm, I'm in a restaurant. I'm like, hey, how are you doing? Hey, good to see you. You'll pay for the whole seat, but you'll only need the edge. We also have a mechanical bull, and you can see it kind of right back there. Yeah, so. I, I definitely want to check that out. Okay. Like that's something I can try and do. Sure, why not? We're based here in Central Kentucky, but we go all over the country and parties, picnics, festivals. Rodeos, you find That's us there. That's a fun gig. It's you just not, watch not people bad. get thrown off. All I throw day. them off. I throw them off. Oh, you're in control I'm of the bull. Ah, yeah. Okay. Well, yes, it's me v you now. That's right. So I'm going to take care of you. You want to sit very close to the rope. Hold the rope down low. Okay. When he goes left, you go right. When he goes forward, you go back. You got to ride it. You can't out muscle it. Rebecca Sanders from Kentucky just got wiped out. Rotary's the producer of this rodeo. It's a fundraiser so that we can do uh, good in the world, basically. We've been around since 1915. Largest and oldest humanitarian organization in the city. Every dollar that we make here will go to do some good in the world. I try to find some cowboy boots. Apparently they're actually really expensive. To get like they're real good, cowboy they're, they're boots. They're good quality and they last a long time, so yeah. yeah. It's worth the investment, yes, right? It's it worth the investment, yes, okay. for sure. Look at these boots. These are real. Yes. Real. They are real. They're not and, the pointy toe dressy pad. Right, these are made for actually doing stuff. Yes, because we'll be down on the floor tomorrow night. Yeah? Uh, well, what are you going to do down well, there? Oh, no, we, we break down all, the whole oh, thing. <laughs> maybe you were going to be... We all do everything. <laughs> really? I thought maybe you were going to no. be roping cattle or no, something. No, I've never even ridden a horse. <laughs> do you know what dot-com commercial I'm the voice of? No. You don't have to be lonely. You're the farmer's only guy. Oh, my God. All right, you ready? I'm going to give it to you. Sorry. I'm going to give it to you. Ready? City folks just don't get it. Oh my God! <laughs> that is awesome. City folks just don't get it. I met the farmers only guy. I'm fanning myself. <laughs> We're coming to the end of a long but fun day here at the Lexington Rodeo. It's been a blast. Thanks to the Rotary Club for putting this together and for having me out here and teaching me the ways. You guys should come next year. It's for a great cause. Back to you, Lee. Thank you, Rebecca. And that's how Chris found his wife on FarmersOnly.com.